What's up guys, cgags 23 hd here, and welcome to episode 6 of Reuniting Czechoslovakia. We did lose a player last episode, but fortunately that player was not Marion Gavrik, so that's all that really matters. Uh, again, we're rocking with only 3 gold players in the team, hopefully we can add another gold player in this episode. Without further ado, let's get into the first game. Go Gavrik. Go Gavrik. Pass. One-timer. Goal. Was that Sedlock? No, Seacatch put that in on a pass from Gabrick. Gabrick using that blistering speed to get past the defenseman and get into a nice passing area for that one-timer goal, and we get the early 1-0 lead, a rarity in this series. Klinka goal! Oh, wow! How did he miss that? Jeez! Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Look how slow my defense is. And he just messed up. I think, uh, I think he meant to deke there and shot it on accident. Oh, wow. Go. Neja Schleb with the poke and the breakaway and can't score. And that is the end of the first period. We're getting outshot 8-2, to two, but we have more time on attack. Most of his shots are uh, just shots from the point. Not very threatening shots, so... Um, that's why, even though he has a lot more shots, we have the lead and more time on attack. Crap. Crap, 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 nice save. And that's the end of the second period, still with a 1-0 lead, a very uneventful period, really nothing happened at all. We're getting outshot 17-5, to but still, we have more time on attack. Uh, again, it's the same style of play. I'm more, you know, kind of twirl around in the offensive zone until I get a good opportunity. He's more throw it at the net and see what happens. And uh, so far, my strategy is working out better, obviously, because I have that one nothing lead. No, no, no! Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Come on! That is the worst goal ever. Shot it right at the goalie. Goalie just lets up the biggest frickin' rebound I've ever seen in my life, and the defender decides to kick it in the fucking net. Not only is it now a tie game, we also lose the extra player for the shutout. That's what I was gunning for here, uh, going for that shutout. But, uh, nope. Nope, my defender decided to kick it in his own net. I guess the throw it at the net strategy finally did work out for him. Doesn't matter, we're taking the lead back. Oh my god, his goalie makes that save. Hike up, pass. Oh, Linka hit the bar. Bar. He hit the post, not the bar. Alright, we got a power play here. 17 seconds left in regulation, so obviously, if we don't score in these 17 seconds, it'll uh, go over into overtime, which is fantastic. Having a 4 on 3 is uh, a lot better than a 5 on 4. So, uh, that looks like that will be the case here. Unless I can score right now. Nope, nope Seacatch decides not to pick up the puck. So, we will be going to overtime. Unfortunately, we should have had the one nothing shutout victory, but my freaking dumbass defenseman decided to kick the puck into his own net. We're getting outshot 31-8, to but again, the time on attack, he only has 5 minutes and 31 seconds to my 8 minutes. He's literally just walking in, flinging the puck on the net, and then trying to get the rebound, except he's not getting any of the rebounds. I'm just picking up all the rebounds and skating it out. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, good. See catch, walk in and scores! Game winner, Yuri see catch, patiently waits for an opening and uh, puts it in the back of the net when he gets it. We get the 2-1 overtime victory, means uh, unfortunately uh, we don't get the shutout, which we should have had, but uh, anyway we do get the win, so we get to add two players to the team, hopefully some gold players. Uh, let's go find out. By the way, Sindelar finally playing half decent. Alright. All of the players are in the list. Please give me a gold, at least one gold. Peter Mrazek, yes! We get a goalie, a gold goalie, that is huge. And uh, Peter Huzevka, gotta figure out who he is uh, as well. Do a little Hut Plaza search and uh, add them both to the team. Let's go. So this is what the team is looking like now. Uh, we put Mrazek as our starting goalie, obviously 84 overall, it's just beautiful. Um, Sindelar is now the backup over Kutsky, and uh, this new guy here, Huzevka, put on the third line here uh, for chemistry purposes. He's better offensively than a lot of the players we had, but uh, he's kind of slow, which is uh, unfortunate. 
I think it's probably because he's like really old. How old is he? He's 39. So uh, it's understandable why he's slow. All right, let's take this much improved team uh, into the second game of the episode. All right, my next opponent actually has a mic in. Um, I can't hear what he's saying because my TV volume is off, but he does have a mic in, so uh, hopefully he's saying nice things. Uh, also looks like he has a PK Subban there, so uh, his team is probably pretty good. Ah, and he scored. <sighs> Fantastic. Your typical uh, one-timer, and it goes in. He takes the early 1-0 lead. He actually has John Scott here, so I have a little respect for him. I tried to plug in the headphones to hear what he was saying, but he has his mic really low, and I couldn't understand anything over the game sound. Come on, new guy. Forget his name. Pass. Oh, Heika. Again, Heika misses. What a shock. No, no, no. Nice save, Mrazek. And that's the end of the first period. We're losing 1-0. Um, it's a pretty back-and-forth game. I think he's probably outplaying me, uh, to be honest, yeah, for sure. But uh, I think we can definitely have a shot at at least tying the game, maybe taking it to overtime. And Gabrick, oh, you're supposed to go back to the forehand. I think I might have had that if I had gone back to the forehand. All right, Dej, let's go. Let's go. Oh, my God. Look, see what I mean? He's just so slow compared to his players. Here we go, Gabrick, someone with some speed. Let's go. Show it off. And, oh, he put it through, behind the goalie, in fact. Gabrick, pass, goal! Oh, wow, what a save. He's got that new flashback goalie in that, I forget his name. Uh, the French guy, what's, I can't remember his name, but that's who he has in that, and uh, he's playing very well for him. And that is the end of the second period. Second period? Yeah, second period. Forgot what period it was for a second. We're still getting out shot, we're still getting out time and attacked. But uh, we're still in the game, we're definitely in the game, and we can definitely make a comeback. Alright, come on. Heike, snipe it! No. Why would I let Heike shoot? That was the dumbest decision ever, he can't score. Here we go, here we go, pass that, come on, Oh damn it! Let's go, Gabaric with that burst of speed, yes! 57 seconds left, and he puts it in the back of the net to tie the game at 1. Beautiful goal from Gabrick. He just turned on the Jets there, blew past his defenders, and tucked it in the back of the net. Great job by Gabrick there to get the game tied. Oh my god. Couldn't even make it to overtime, right? Had to be freaking six seconds later. Alright, this face-off here is pretty much our last chance to tie this up. We need to win it, and we didn't, so that's pretty much the game. Uh, Gabrick stole the puck, though, so maybe not... Shoot it! Oh, my own player kind of got in the way. Or did it get through? I'm not really sure. Oh, yes! Sea catch! 12.4 seconds left! A beauty! One-timer from Gabrick to retie the game. Holy crap! Looks like we are not going to give up a goal like six seconds later and actually make it to overtime. Jeez. <laughs> He has double shots, he has a third more time on attack, uh, but realistically, like, it's it's kind of an even game-ish. I mean, as far as goals per opportunity, if that makes sense, there it's, it's kind of the same. Really, we both had the same number of good opportunities, and we both scored when we should have scored, and didn't score when we shouldn't have scored. <laughs> he just freaking, like teleported across the ice, completely defied all the laws of physics and just floated opposite of the direction he was hit. Alright, we got a two on one, pass, goal, oh, almost. Yes, oh, wow. Schuster made a pass to Sevich, two defensemen, up on the play, and uh, he just barely couldn't get it by the goalie, if that makes sense. Barely, just narrowly missed scoring. Gabarik, pass, goal, yes! Sea catch with the overtime goal. What a performance by uh, Gabrick and Sea catch, both uh, scoring and uh, picking up some assists in the last time of the game, and we somehow managed to pull out the win from this game. Holy crap! I don't know how we did that. 
that was uh, that was impressive. Gabrick with the goal and two assists. Seacatch with two goals. Uh, obviously, Gabrick had the first tying goal. Seacatch had the second tying goal with like 16 seconds left or something like that, and the overtime goal. And Mrazic played fantastic. Uh, three gold players getting the three stars shows you uh, that there is definitely a difference uh, between player ratings. So we do get two players for the win. Uh, no shutout, no hat trick, so only two players. Let's find out who we're adding. More gold players would be just amazing, but I'm not expecting it. And you know what? Even if we don't get it, I'll still be happy because we got Mrazic. We got a gold goalie. Randomize me. Three, two, one. Um, don't know either of those players, so that means they're both silver players. Uh, maybe one of them or both of them could be uh, decent. If they're like 78 plus, that's still pretty solid. So uh, let me go look them up and then uh, add them to the team. So to finish off the episode, this is what the team looks like. Only change, uh, besides the fact that everyone somehow needs a contract, is that uh, Banak is thrown in here on the second pairing with Harabal, and um, we didn't put, I forget his name, the other defenseman that we got, he was also a defenseman, he was a left defenseman, uh, we didn't put him on the team because of chemistry reasons and because he's just not that good. He's only a 75 overall, so it's not worth it to throw off the chemistry for like a plus one increase. And my voice just like cracked there. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, smash that like button. Uh, leave a comment down below. Subscribe for more videos. And I'll see you guys next time.